But the guys, that was perfect. I'm going to show you four more hidden features and I was 11 bit of success found today. First thing is, thank you guys so much for 3,900 subscribers today. I'm very happy for this. Now to the features. First one is the, the text in the about section now spaced out a lot more than it was in the previous beta. So I got iOS 10 with me to show you it at the same time. So when you go to settings on both of them, let me get to my about page. In both of them. And as you can see here, the text is way more spaced out on this one. See here, look at iOS 10 on the right and iOS 11 on the left. As you can see the difference. The way you can see the difference is because the version number is way down here now. Previously it's up here and now it's spaced down a lot more. So you can see that? 10 and 11. See all the text spaced out a lot more. Spaced out text and about. Next one is new next one is new box in the new box in the Apple ID pop-up. So when you purchase an app now or try to get an app, there is now the the install button has the new box around it. When you click get. If you see right here, the the in, the in, the get button has been changed to install, and now it does the big blue blue install button. Now it's a big blue install button instead of the old fashioned get with the line. It's now big and blue now to tell you where it is. Really cool. Next one is the drag and you can now drag and drop screenshots instead of the share sheet when you tap and hold the iPad. But instead of instead of the share sheet, I've discovered this. You have three options. You could tap it. You can tap and hold to get the share sheet, or you could tap and you could tap and hold and drag it like this. So you could tap tap and drag it to a new note just like that. So tap and drag for your screenshots on the iPad. The last one is installing 32-bit apps. The install button is now grayed out instead of letting you keep it on your home screen. So let me go to my app store to show you this one. So like when I go to my purchase section here on both of them is to demonstrate this one. So like the camcorder app here, the 32-bit app, and look at the difference. See, in iOS 11 beta 6, the little download cloud but it's now grayed out. Previously, this wasn't grayed out and it lets you keep the apps on your home screen. But now Apple's completely disabled all 32 apps so they will not allow you to keep 32-bit 32 apps, 32 apps on your home screen. See, I cannot click the download button, it's all grayed out compared to this one where I can click it. So, Apple Slim Pay 6 will no longer let you install 32-bit apps or keep it on your home screen for good. So, the button will be grayed out, so you can no longer click it at all. So, those are the, those are the four iOS 11 Beta 6 features that I found. I'm still finding a lot more, so more coming more come in the future videos. So, that's it for this video. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, see my video.